For 52 consecutive nights of live concerts, his followers joined from all over the world, unbothered by the tinny sound of his piano when it lapsed out of tune. They kept coming, he kept playing. Because of the pandemic. And so what usually must be right was wrong. And it didn't matter. Because just, just the fact that there was music, no matter how it sounded, just the fact that there was some kind of togetherness, just, just this was enough for people to feel better. It was enough for me to feel better. So much better, he next streamed what was less a challenge to his musical talents than to his musical stamina. The Vexations is not exactly a reliable crowd pleaser. The Vexations, which is a very odd, very weird kind of non-music piece. It doesn't really make sense. It starts with one hand alone, then you play a weird variation, then you play the same thing again, one hand alone, then you play another variation. French surrealist composer Eric Satie intended this piece to be played through 840 times. The repetition can be almost hypnotic, known to cause performers to hallucinate. One complained of seeing bugs crawling between the keys. Levitt played this piece for 16 hours straight. Igor, that sounds like torture and not music. Well, uh, vexations, right? <laughs> I rest my case. And so I thought, wow. That's the perfect match for this time. And I could focus with this performance on the emotional and mental state of mind of my world, of the performance world, which is hopelessness, confusion, and like give, give like a silent scream, like the end of the third part of The Godfather. You survived. I not only survived, I was high as a monkey afterwards. I mean, I was, I was just flying. <laughs> 